Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video, we are going to solve this given quintic equation x power 3 times x square minus 28 equals to negative 171 x. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Let's go ahead and get started with the solution and here's the very first thing we are going to do. Let me go ahead and distribute this one. So therefore, we are going to get x power 5 minus 28 x power 3 equals to negative 171 x. Now let's go ahead and move this negative 171 x to the left hand side. Now we can see that x is in common among all these three terms. So therefore we are going to factor out x and we are ended up with the x power 4 minus 28x square plus 171 equal to 0. And now we cut these two factors equal to 0. We can separate them. I can write x equal to 0. And the other factor is x power 4 minus 28x square plus 171 equal to 0. Now we can see that x equal to 0 is one of our solutions. And now let's focus on this equation. Uh, let's go ahead and tweak this x power 4. x power 4 could be written as x square and then whole square minus 28x square plus 171 equals to 0. To make our job easier, let me go ahead and make a substitution. Let me go ahead and call this x square as u and this x square is going to be a u as well. Then our this equation is simply going to become u square minus 28u plus 171 equal to 0. And now we can see that this is our quadratic equation and we are going to solve this one by grouping and factoring. So therefore let's focus on this negative 28u. We can write this one as negative 9u and minus 19u. As you can see in this next step, now let's focus on these first two terms. In this pair we can see u is in common and between these last two terms we can see that nine, negative 19 is common. So therefore we can factor out u and we ended up u minus 9 and let me factor out negative 19 over here. So we ended up with u minus 9 equals to 0 and now we can see u minus 9 and u not minus 9 is in common. So therefore I can factor out u minus 9 times u minus 19 equals to 0. And let's go ahead now separate these two factors. First factor is going to be u minus 9 equal to 0 and the other factor is going to be u minus 19 equal to 0. So therefore this first equation is going to become u equals to positive 9 and this second equation is going to become u equals to 19. And here we got u equals to 9 value and here u equals to 19. But then we know that u equals to x square. Our substitution, let's go ahead and compare these equations so we are going to get uh, x square equals to 9. Let's go ahead and undo this square by taking the square root on uh, both uh, sides. So the left hand side is going to become x equal to positive or negative 3. So therefore x equal to positive 3 and x equal to negative 3 are our other two solution. On this uh, next equation u equals to 19. We know that u equals to x square so therefore x square is going to be equal to 
19. Go ahead and take the square root on both sides. So therefore, we are going to have x equal to positive or negative square root of 19. So therefore, we are going to have two more solutions, x equal to square root of 19 and the other one x equal to negative square root of 19. These are our two more solutions. So therefore, we got these two solutions, these solutions and this solution x equal to 0 as well. And thus here are our all the solutions. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.